Ooh, they're all playing like Sakai and on offense. Like more than on defense. Well, actually, Viper is playing some on defense. Also, one Herbertist. Why not? I think the unit our value is pretty high. Or can be insanely high. It's basically an inf infinite value, right? Um, Depending on if they get some here or not. And you also see a lot of pikes on uh, white blood side here. Not as much cap on um, Argonauts. So again, it looks good for them. Looks fine, man. Really looks fine. One flame before offense is really, really low, though. 240 defenders. For the camera, the shadow is pretty, pretty high. And not any hero changers, so they're playing with the same hero classes here. Um, I think the three muskets is a big advantage for Wild Blood on this map. To be honest. But yeah, we're gonna see. Double Jeffs being picked up and um, actually also one X uh, Raider, man. One of the X throwers is in. Let's go. So yeah, like standard uh, A attack here. I'm not actually splitting, having some people on B first to make sure they are not getting cheesed. <laughs> but yeah, coming into A now. Everyone moving over. Jeff's moving on the wall. Muskets actually are uh, not on the wall yet, so that's pretty good for Argonauts. She just uh, on the side here, so main gate is pretty safe at the moment. I like how the white blood is positioned. This is like an invitation to uh, just take the main gate. And they're not in position to flank yet. Uh, they might want to set something up, but they're not in position yet. So, um, yeah. Oh, is Pike going to get away? Yeah, they're going to get away. Maybe they just uh, don't have info what's inside. And now they're just going to see, oh, ah, okay, man. Like, oh, it's free. <laughs> Who would have guessed it's free? Uh, they're actually pushing on two sides at the same time. I don't think this is a smart because why plot at this point can actually punish them really hard for it you can just take like a free good trade and then just get out and go home and you just uh get him dropped your first blood i don't know it's frontline in good position they actually uh, look like they're winning the war as well i plot not really um committing to one of the fights trying to fight uh both or regrouping at the same time and they just need to go home they just lost so much like yeah like this is actually already in the bad spot i'm gonna need to be careful to not overextend with their main force in the center like this is i think a bit too far maybe even and they're gonna get outnumbered in the center if they don't send reinforcements and yeah the mpo pike's gonna make sure that they do have some uh, reinforcements available the right side of argonauts is gonna fall in the second flame is from white blood arriving uh, nice again militia here um oh the trap is gonna just hold them off they, they they're gonna trap themselves no trap themselves bro trap themselves and the board are not doing anything while, while the right side is fighting the fight right side is super hard fighting and the board is just staying brace and, and on one spot here <laughs> more gonna try to pick something up and yes i said right side are really really well uh played by white blood and at least the Ford are gonna, I mean, oh, there was the five head play, right? I thought they're just gonna sit there for, for 10 years because in like year 11, then one cap is probably gonna blindly charge into the price for that didn't move for like uh, 60 seconds plus. Yeah, that, that can happen. So, um, okay, I give it to the Ford player here. Um, really nice cataphract charge, and, and now just uh, clean up the AFK 40. Why I brought Krilling the point? I'm gonna a little bit of uh, distraction on B, but. Uh, they need to regroup now and re-push. They did lose some um, kind of some units, but Wyblad did as well. Wyblad need to regroup. Agonauts can um, 
Insta spawn and push A again. If they were super quick on it, then my plot is going to be a little late on the plane. That's when you can get A. Let's see what's actually going on. Yeah, not moving instantly. I mean, you gotta wait for some respawns. My plot's still pretty heavily on this B side here. And okay, sending one guy onto the B side, one guy to go flank. Actually, second unit should be a retreating one. And now my blood is in a really bad position for this uh, Argonauts set up if they're quick and don't wait too long then you see Argo uh, white blood is late to the play and argonauts could use the time but if they play it too slow and it looks like they're kind of slow like waking the entire time and it's um maybe over like the time window might be closing or oh, taking the forward position here um it's maybe a little bit too forward i mean this photo should just uh, die for free and yeah, the, the four players really are uh, interesting here playing the line formation, playing F2. And uh, rare to be seen. What's the Kev doing? Kev, 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 Kev. Scaling advanced by Imperial Pikes. Good job, Imperial Pike player on point. You, he did learn from. Hongonauts did learn from the first game. And uh, you used Imperial Pikes against Kev, man. Good fucking job. Um, yeah, it should be free A cap for them. Um, they're just uh, holding here now. They need to have some reinforcements onto this middle. Otherwise, our Cavs just going to run it over. Imperial Pikes did use the advance already. So uh, the Pikes that have been braced to the right should have been moved to the left instantly. They just... Uh, okay, they just waited for some Cav randomly coming around the corner um, after the whole team died. But it's fine. It's fine. Um, still in a decent spot. Can still win the game. My blood coming in one by one. A lot of cap actually, so they were super quick on the on the comeback here. Yeah, if, if you play a forward like this, then you're just gonna get um heavy armors from the side and behind and just killing them. Look at this Polex, look at this Polex slicing him up and slicing him. He's just slicing him. No one even touching him. He like he doesn't care. He's like, oh yeah, you don't see me, man. I'm actually invisible to you and <laughs> Dude, man, he's just getting free slices on the full unit. Yeah, but fight on the on the point still. No problem is uh Palace Guard's gonna annihilate these uh Imperial Pikes on the right side. If some calf on the left, that is not to be answered at the moment. Unit count is super low already. Oh man, like, I think Wiplet wanna commit here and um, Argonauts has the numbers advantage. So it is gonna depend on them if they're able to clear uh, the point and keep the heroes out of the point, right? This is the uh, the issue here. I'd probably like be safe from a possible capture. Gian is just uh, on his way, coming from supply. His cataplex on his back, like you see him like on the bridge already. This guy is gonna most likely clear the entire point. point if he groups up the calf, the calf's not really grouped, but maybe he can still do a good a good charge here. Getting intercepted. Kev getting stopped. Good hero play here. Short sword in the front. Also salvage that and uh, yeah, master man. Well played there. Well played there. Catching the cataphracts and, and now they're instantly moving. Why don't you pick the the free units? Okay, two guys picking up the free units. I didn't say anything. Good. Um, people could go for C. I think berserker spawn would be the better play here but like um yeah the white blood is smart um really smart um no i have to go to the end point the best spot to defend at this time uh they are a little bit down on the units of 421 to 585 uh, but i don't know it's also lost my units so uh white blood also lost my units looks like i has the advantage to be honest looking at the unit lineup it's piss weak at the moment and also so many forty. Oh man, like so many forty on 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 white blood side left. You know what that means? They're gonna get rained by Zakarian and die. They're gonna get rained by Jeff and die. Um, if uh, Argonauts plays this controlled and slow, then there is no way that uh white blood can do anything with uh, those units unless uh, they do uh, use their ranged units extremely well and protect them extremely well. Then. They actually have a good shot on now winning here. That's like their win condition at the moment. It's like the strongest uh, force that they have. 
have also two palace guards for the front line. That's not too much. Nothing to do place even because you need to keep it in the front line. And I don't know. So having a lot of damage on their lineup and should use the poke that they have. Also, I've got here holding the high ground. Um, smart thing. I'm poking with Sakaian. <laughs> not hitting it, but uh, yeah, he is going to keep practicing now. Oh, they're slowing down Argonauts a lot, and Argonauts also like on the backside five people. Um, I get some deja vu from keyboard warriors, man. <laughs> to be honest, I mean they're occupying some people, but you all also weaken your your main lineup. Look at how much calf there is, and yeah, like how are these guys gonna set up a proper push? Maybe it's a different way around. Like maybe the main push is on the left. Unorthodox, but uh. Checking the units here. It's more, uh, it's a lot of hero damage and stuff. Forda could be trapped. This photo could be trapped. Defense position here and the small arrow is pretty good. So like this is something that needs to be weakened before you can breach it. And now we see five Argonauts just facing, I think like 10 of my blood. What's going on? Like Argonauts completely scattered around the map and can't really group up for a play here. They're losing a lot of time. I mean, at the moment, they're still fine. Should pick up the Zakai Militia there. Like, it's super, super free. Let's see if the uh, Birdsword is gonna get them. Most likely not. Actually, Zakai getting out for free again, man. Like, oof, rough, tough. Rough, tough spot. Argonauts pushing from the backside. Now, actually, Cav coming in. Charging into the braced, braced uh, for the Baracho here. I don't know um, if they didn't see them. Maybe the sticks are too thin. No, too thin wooden sticks, I guess. Uh, good push. I think the beer packs are going to advance from the side. Yeah, baited the Imperial, uh, uh, the, the Shot Sword there as well. And there's a Kayan just a um, bit late, in my opinion. They can still do the work, they can still do the work. Argonauts still in a big unit lead here. They should win if they have the time, and four minutes should be actually enough. A nice Akai okay, Militia value again. Burning all those palace guards, they're gonna drop, and uh, yeah, they're just all the heroes from White Blood vanishing. Finally, Zakaian is gonna die. I mean, like, well played by the Zakaian player. Cecilia here, like, uh, getting the unit out every time and um, getting the value off. Uh, GG, it's a tie. Uh, all right, so I think second place uh, still not decided yet. Well played to both of the guys, uh, Grumpy MVP here for uh, White Blood and Cybertard man. Also, really, really nice uh, KF stop there on a um, stop the uh, Cataphrax charge was really, really nice. Well played, nice games, nice games, nice games. G to the G.